Hey there everyone, Paradise Gamer 13 here, and let's play V. I have no idea where to go from here, so I'm probably gonna have to fall down a bunch of holes and ultimately get extremely lost until... And, oh, there's a treasure chest. Well, that too, I guess. But, uh, and it's a booster pack for that matter. Premiere. Let's see what this does. That's a Duck Trio. These Duck Trios are actually really powerful, and I don't know why I don't have one. Oh yeah, I don't really care that much about that though. That's what, I knew there was like some drawback, but... Um... Starmie, Growl with Finnet, Bill, Ponytail, and Nidoran, and Switch, Grass Energy. Okay. Maybe I am actually going... Okay. Up. Oh, wow. That worked. <laughs> well, I guess I, I shouldn't speak too soon. Oh, yeah. I really don't know. Uh, well, that worked. The chest. Oh, look. I got a promotional Dug Trio and now a promotional Diglett. Uh, <laughs> Peck? Why does he know Peck? That's no explanation for that whatsoever, I guess. Rolling movement. This tech is, eh. Interesting. Well, anyways, I don't really know. Ah! No. I went so far. But, alas, I did not quite get to where I had hoped. So, again, let's, I guess, play the skip through until I actually get some more game, maybe. Um, yeah, I really don't have a clue where I'm at at this point. Oh, no, this is where I was just like a second ago. Um, I guess there's no harm in trying to go this way. I wish there was a, a way that you could tell where the holes are. Like, okay, wow. Okay, I was like, I was like walking really slowly, like that would help me, but maybe it actually did. No, it probably didn't, but still, I like to think it did. Ha 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 ha! Come on, come on, come on! It is I, Tony, of Team GR's Fighting Fortress. I don't negotiate. It's pointless. I'd much rather fight with cards. I just loathe people who try to drain my spirit or energy. I hate all decks with. Oh, interesting. Always oh, stuck using weak. <laughs> Well, obviously, that's kind of the point of it. Clubmaster here, that you'll lose it. You, I probably will, but uh, I need to set my deck first. So, I will be right back. Alright, so my deck is all ready to go here. I'm actually just using a slightly altered variation of um, the deck I used in the last match. Um, I basically decided, instead of the man keys and the primates, even though they served me well in that last match, I think I have enough Duck Trios I'm going to have to go with Diglets and Duck Trios in this one, because... Oh! Okay. Oh, and I took out my one energy removal and replaced it with, uh, something. Potion? No! Oh, no! I replaced it with a challenge card! That's what I did! I knew it was, like, something, um... Something unique. So that's pretty cool. Um, right off the bat, I start off with, a Actually, a really good hand. Um, that's... Obviously, as I've learned from my past mistakes, Especially since I have no other basic Pokemon at the moment. Um, not necessarily a sign of good things to come. Although I do have Dark Machoke, who I can pretty much get up and going pretty pretty quickly here. Well, I guess it takes three energies before I can do much, but still. We'll see how it goes. And I go first, too, on top of all that. And I get another fighting energy. So really, all these great things. And I'm going as a normal type. Are you kidding? Well, you're just asking for trouble. <laughs> oh... Oh, this is, uh, yeah. I don't want to say anything, but, uh, hopefully you can deduce what the situation. I swear, this game messes with me on purpose. Like, how many times I, I, I just go from being so ridiculously horrible to all of a sudden being, like, really good. And I don't understand how it happens or why. It makes no sense to me. Like, all the bad things happen to me, and all the good things, and it just kind of constantly goes back and forth. Um, I just really don't think I can get any better than this. Dishing out 40 damage a turn to this this guy right here. That is pretty intense. Uh, will I take him out next turn? I didn't pay it. I don't think I do. No, if I had a plus power, I would. Watch me draw a plus power. That would be completely in line with my luck for this. Uh, well, he actually drew a fighting type, though, so good for him. But uh, that would be completely in line with the way things have been going so far. And I could get paralyzed, which I did, actually. That's a bummer. Not gonna lie. But. I can just sit 
and not do much of anything, because I really don't care. Oh no, I got paralyzed. What can I do? I guess maybe I could definitely attach that fighting energy and then go down to this dark machoke and then attach it to have a chop and evolve him and then use one of these moves. I think it's knockback, which does damage and then changes or something. Yeah. Yep, okay. So we are going to knock him back. And by that I mean knock him out, per se. Um, and get our first prize card. Because Dark Machoke is just going to destroy all the things. And there's a Dig Trio. My promotional one, I think, actually. As a matter of fact. He's going to do some damage uh, to one of your opponents, but one. I really don't care. I guess he used it on me. I got another Dark Machoke. So, you know. That's just the way things are at this point. Um... I guess I could put this on <laughs> my other Dark Machoke. Um, although, actually, I have I have a Graveler, too, so, I mean, I could just put it on either one, really. But I think I'll put it on, uh, I think I'll put it on the Dark Machoke, just in case I get a Dark Machamp. I have now two options. In case this one gets knocked out, you know, it's really, <laughs> it's really pretty, um, yeah, that's the way things are. Uh, does that, uh, he has two other Lickitungs. That's pretty... Pretty efficient. Um, let's. Hmm. Let's use drag off. I think that's what I'll do. And then just bring out one of the lick of tongues and hit him really hard. And now I should be able to take him out next turn. I think with the with the knockback. Um. So this will go. Really a potion. Okay. I'll take that. And that's pretty much all I will do for now. Yeah, I can definitely take him out with the knockback. So that's beautiful. And I get to draw a prize card. Oh, wait, let's just do a digger. If Tails do 10 damage to your active Pokemon, if heads, your opponent flips a coin. If Tails, your opponent does 10 damage to his or her. Oh, okay. If heads, you flip a coin. Keep doing this until a player gets. Oh. <laughs> that was so stupid too because now I'm going to take him out in one hit that is beautiful like seriously like everything is going my way in this fight I don't even care that I'm saying that at that point and acting super under overconfident because really nothing is going to stop me at this point you have no chance so I don't care about how overconfident I'm being I'm drawing all these fighting energies I'm building up another dark machoke in case this one gets knocked out <clears throat> I have a graveler I have everything I could possibly need to completely <laughs> sweep you, I guess, really. And it's probably what this will amount to end up being. Um, I don't even know that he has other Pokemon waiting on his uh, on his bench. Unless I get par I didn't even get paralyzed there. Like, seriously. <laughs> I really don't think this is going to get any better than that. Um... I'm just going to attack Dark Machoke first. I doubt I'll need that Diglett, but, you know, he's there. I'll have this Doug Trio too, in case I need him. Yeah, this is his last Pokemon anyway, so I can just hit it with all the knockbacks I want. And it won't be able to switch out or anything. Pretty wonderful. And I bet I could use a, uh... I wonder if I could use a Switch even when I'm paralyzed. I'm not sure. Well, I guess we'll find out here. Right? Yeah. First things first, though, I'm going to use this Pokedex. I'll do that, and then that. Oh, wait, no, I won't. I'll do that, and then that, and that, and that, and that. Yep, even though I probably won't even need it. Oh, yeah, I can. <laughs> this is awesome. I'm just going to switch right into him and just do that. And there we go. That is the match for me. So I won without even losing a single prize card, which is just incredibly uh, different than my previous matches, with the exception of the last one too, I guess. Like I was headband is busted now after this. It was just such an intense, intense match. Also, I like how the leader caged himself in there. I just now realized that too. Whoa, I was beaten. And an ambition boost back. 
We're getting a lot of these booster packs recently. Oh, wow, it's a Moltres. Dry up and fire away. Choose one of your opponents. Pokemon flip a coin until you get tails. For each heads, discard it. Ooh, interesting. Would have been useful to have in the water fort, I guess. And Firewing, which is just a straight up 50 damage. Okay. Foster Oaks Revenge, Dark Marowak. Another challenge card. Goop Gas Attack, Super Scoop Up, Meowth, Porygon, Slowpoke, Nightly Garbage Run. Okay. And Assault. I think I have got one of these before. I was about to say, is that another new one or that I haven't seen before? But I don't. Well, I haven't seen this one, though. Mountain Break and 1 2 Strike. Take the first five cards. Wow. Put all fighting energies into your hand. Oh, okay. Oh, wait, discard. Whoa, 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 I don't know if I like that. That's dangerous. Flip a coin. If has this attack, does 20 additional damage. I do like that, though, to some extent. Twister and fly. Once this Pokemon knocks out, depending Pokemon, flip a coin. If has return all energy cards, return cards attached to that Pokemon to your opponent's hand. Eh, okay. Oh, wait. Uh, you know. Hand, whatever. Flip a coin. If has during your opponent's print all effects of attacks. Are you serious? Oh, but if it tails is... I mean, I, I guess that's fair. Metapod. Green Shield. Huh. Interesting. Okay. That's not a bad card for Metapod. He has 70 HP, too. Holy cow, that's one powerful. And it's only level 20. It's a powerful Metapod. Arbok, Weedle. That's an interesting looking Weedle. I don't think I have... What is it with them all knowing Peck? Um, that Diglett knew it too. That's kind of weird. Recycle. A Nidoran male. That's a different one too. Focus energy. Uh, Horn Rush's base power is doubled. Ooh, oh, but it does. Uh, you know. Gambler, Pidgey, Star You. Okay. Gah, beaten, beaten. I was beaten. I lost the gamble, which means I lost the Club Master as well. Oh, that was, I thought that was uh, the one guy. I was thinking, didn't he say Clubmaster? I was thinking that was like, as in, oh, I was thinking like the Fighting Fortress Master. <laughs> That's kind of, okay, it makes a lot more sense now. Thank you, PG-13, you saved me. It seems my training wasn't good enough to avoid capture. This is an expression of my gratitude. Please accept it. A promotional card? Cool, Porygon. Sounds very cool indeed. Texture magic. <laughs> That's got to be about the most majestic sounding attack so far that I've found. 50 HP. You may change cool Porygon's resistance to a type of your choice other than regular. If the defending Pokemon has a weakness, you may change it. Oh, wow, so it's basically both conversions in one. That is very magical, I guess, so to say. Um, flip three coins, does 30, 20 damage. Is that basically... I think that's basically what the other three attack did um, from that other Pokemon I typically used. Um, I'll head back over to the fighting club. Oh! Okay. I remember. Okay. I was thinking it was another one of the Grandmasters, which is why I was confused that I kept saying Clubmaster. Okay. I'd like to go together with you, but I can see you prefer to stay. Yeah, I don't know if I'd be able to find my way back out anyways, so... Are you certain, Joni? I am to take these booster packs? I don't mind. <laughs> Seriously! We have an arrangement that must be honored since I've been defeated. Take them. They're fifth edition packs. That's the Flight series. I see. Then I suppose this is goodbye. I am strong when something's online, but you're much stronger. PG-13, do what you like. I'll be here fighting on. Seriously, these <laughs> villains need to uh, rethink their strategies. But nonetheless, that's going to be it for this part. If you guys liked it, I'd appreciate you hitting that like button. Also, subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so and you want to get notified of future content and stuff. And as always, hope you guys enjoyed, and thanks again for watching.